Good morning. Come on in. Bells are ringing. Bells are ringing. Hear them chime. Hear them chime. Calling all the babies. Calling all the babies. It's gym class time. It's gym class time. Hi, everyone. Good morning. I hope you are ready to get our arms moving today and our work on our core as well. But you know what? I'm missing my dog, Romney. Maybe we can call him out. Grownups, you're going to have your little one sit in your laps. And we're going to put our arms out wide, out to the side. And we're going to rock from side to side as we sing. Oh, where, oh, where can Rumpy be? Oh, where, oh, where can he be? With his big brown eyes and his waggly tail. Let's wag our tails. Oh, where, oh, where can he be? I know. Let's count to three. And then we're going to say, Come out, Rompy. You ready? One, two, three. Come out, Rompy! <coughs> I heard two barks. Rompy? <gasps> Rompy, did you bring a friend with you today? Oh my goodness. Rompy has his own little Rompy. This is Rompy's favorite toy. Well, Rompy, I'm going to set your little Rompy aside, okay? Whew. Now, Rompy loves to say hello. So we are going to rock back and forth once more. And this time we're going to sing. Oh, here we are at Romp and Roll, at Romp and Roll, at Romp and Roll. Oh, here we are at Romp and Roll. Let's put our hands out front, go whoosh. And we're gonna wiggle their hands and jiggle their hands. We're gonna say, get ready for some fun. And fun with Mr. Daniel, that's me. And fun with Rumpy, that's him. And fun with Lil Rumpy. And fun with all of his friends, that's you. <laughs> One more time, let's rock back and forth. And we're gonna sing, Oh, here we are at Romp and Roll. Whoosh! Get ready for some fun! We are gonna have so much fun today. Not only are we going to be bouncing up and down, working on our core muscles, but we're gonna get our arms A moving with some great big hugs and moving in all sorts of other different directions. And you know what? I know a story here in my backpack all about getting a great big hug. Do you want to hear it? Let's try. We're going to start by patting our legs just like so. And we're going to do a little chant. You are ready? Here we go. We'll say, what's in the backpack? What's in the backpack? What's in the backpack? Let's all look. Let's see what's in our backpack today. Hmm, today is a story called Hug. You know what? Hugs are a great way to help our little ones feel safe and secure. We're going to wrap our arms one and then the other, just like so. Give them a great big squeeze. Let them know that you're here. And then while we do it, we can do a nice little trunk rotation as we go. Ready? Here, I'm going to come closer. Rompy, do you mind sitting out for a little bit? Thank you. This is Bobo, and Bobo needs a hug. Hug? Oh, it looks like they're hugging. Here, let's hug our little one. Hug to the chameleons. Hug 
to the snakes. But who hugs Bobo? Hmm. Oh, Bobo's looking pretty sad. Hug? Huh. Oh, we have to go find a hug for Bobo. Hug? There's some lions. And they're hugging on each other's bellies. Hug? There's some hippos. And they're hugging on each other's backs. Hug? Oh no. Where's Bobo's hug? Hug. Aw. Bobo's so sad. Bobo! <gasps> Who is that? Mommy! Hug, hug, hug. Let's give our little ones a hug, hug, hug. Oh, and now Bobo's hugging everybody. Hug. Everybody hug. Oh, how sweet. You know what? I'm gonna give Rumpy a hug right now. We're gonna hug him nice and close. And you know what? We can even try this. I'm gonna let Rumpy hug me on my belly. I'm gonna lay down like so. Put Rumpy on my belly. You can put your little ones on your belly too. We're gonna roll from side to side. And then we're gonna go up in the air like this. Ta-da! And down. Okay, let's try it again. Hug from side to side. We're gonna arch our back as we go up in the air like this. Ta-da! And back. Oh, wonderful. Well, you know what? Now is a good time as any to help work on our core muscles. Uh, these are our back, core, and neck muscles, the very important muscle groups to making the world a little less wobbly. And today, we're gonna do some lap ride songs. This is a lot like our chair uh, ride songs where we're gonna put our little ones kind of right here on our knees, but today, it's gonna be a lot more comfortable if you do it right here from the floor. In either case, we're going to hold our little ones by their trunk. That means somewhere between their armpit and their hips. For younger babies, hold them by the armpit. That's gonna give them the comfort they need as they exercise their neck. For our bigger friends, hold them by their hips. Make it their job to hold themselves up as we're gonna bounce our legs up and down, just like so. Now we're gonna start with a song about a choo-choo train. It goes like this. We're gonna bounce up and down and say, here comes the choo-choo train coming down the track. Now he's going forward. Let's lean our little ones forward. And now he's going back. Let's lean back, whoa. Listen to the bell ring. Let's lift up our arms, go ding, 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 ding. Let's hear the engine blow, go toot, toot. And now here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do bouncing with our legs all over like so. So that way we go all the way around. Goes what a lot of sound it makes everywhere it goes. Whew. Well, you know what? That was slow, Steve. What do you say we make this train go faster? You ready? We're gonna start to the beat. All together we'll go. Here comes the choo-choo train coming down the track. Now he's going forward, and now he's going back. Listen to the bell ring, ding, ding. Hear the engine blow, toot, toot. What a lot of sound it makes everywhere it goes. Oh, I love that one. But you know what? I want to show you my favorite lap ride song. You ready? It's called The Noble Duke of York and we get to move in all sorts of directions. We're gonna start by hopping up and down. And I'm gonna start off slow, but we're gonna get faster and faster every time, okay? We're gonna start by saying, the noble Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. Now we're gonna go up, up, up. He marched his men to the top of the hill and marched them down again. 
Now we're gonna go a little bit fast. Ready? And when you're up, you're up. Whoosh. And when you're down, you're down. Whoosh. And when you're only halfway up, you're neither up nor down. He marched them to the left. Watch. We're gonna bend this way. Go. Whoa. He marched them to the right. Bend the other way. Go. Whoa. Here comes my favorite part, because then he marched them upside down. We're going to go like this. Whoa! <laughs> Wasn't that a silly sight? Your little ones have been so brave. Let's give them a hug. Ready? Now, what do you say we do that song at half speed? <clears throat> Troops at the ready. <laughs> On your mark. Get set. Here we go. The noble Duke of York. He had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and marched them down again. And when you're up, you're up. And when you're down, you're down. And when you're only halfway up, you're neither up nor down. He marched them to the left. Whoa! He marched them to the right. Whoa! Then he marched them upside down. Wasn't that a silly sight? Oh, how silly. You know what? I'd like to try one more time, but this time we are going to go super duper fast. What do you say? Okay. On your mark. Hup, hup. Get set. Go. The noble Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and marched them back again. And when you're up, you're up. And when you're down, you're down. And when you're only halfway up, you're neither up nor down. He marched them to the left. He marched them to the right, and then he marched them upside down. What a silly sight. Oh, great job, everyone. Whew, I hope we got that core workout in, but now it's time to move our arms. I have a song here in my backpack that's gonna help us move our arms in all directions. Maybe you can help me call it out. Let's start by having our little ones pat their legs, just like so. You ready? Here we go. We'll say, what's in the backpack? What's in the backpack? What's in the backpack? Let's all look. Let's see what else is in our backpack today. Today is a song you may recognize. It's called, <clears throat> The Wheels on the Bus. And I like this one because it gets our arms moving. We're going to start with one of my favorite ones. We're going to move their arms one, two, one, two, one, two, just like so. We call this reciprocal arm motion. It is another step towards that bilateral coordination that means using both sides of your brain to talk to both sides of your body. So, let's try it. Go one, two, one, two. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all through the town. Now let's open our arms up wide and then close them right here to our midline. Go all the way wide and close to the midline. Woof. The doors on the bus go open and shut, open and shut, open and shut. The doors on the bus go open and shut all through the town. Wait, let's try this one. We are gonna actually make our arms cross our midline now, going one side and then all the way to the other. One side and all the way to the other. Let's get our brain paying attention to both sides of our body as we do this. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 swish. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all through the town. Hey, you want to do a little bit more bouncing? Here we go. The people on the bus bounce up and down. Up and down, up and down, the people on the bus bounce up and down, all through the town. Amazing job, everyone. 
But now that we've gotten our arms all warmed up, I think it's time to do some moving with them. We're going to bring out our parachute. Now at home, if you have a, a small towel or a light blanket or a sheet, this will work just fine. But I'm going to bring out my big parachute. So, grown-ups, your little ones are going to get to have some options here. Depending on the size of your baby, your little ones might feel more comfortable laying down on the parachute or on the sheet. They might lay down on their bellies. They might sit in your laps. Or if they're really good at sitting, they might sit right here on top of the parachute all on their own. Rompy's going to sit in my lap. Uh, if you, uh, you, whatever your little one does naturally, that's probably the right thing to do. Now, if you do have your little ones in your laps uh, and you want them to work on the parachute, what I like to do is give them a handle, something to grab on. So I take one finger, I drape my finger, drape the parachute right over my finger like that, so that way Rompy will have a handle to grab onto. Then I can take the rest of my hand and lock it in place. You ready? Come on, Rumpy. There we go. Now let's start nice and simple. We're going to do little shapes up and down and to the beat. We're going to sing, let's shake, shake, shake the parachute, shake, shake, shake the parachute, shake, shake, shake the parachute here at Rump and Roll. Let's try this. We're going to go all the way up and all the way down. Of course, grown-ups, I'm referring to their range of motion, not yours. We want to make sure they have a reach, but if you want to kind of exaggerate a little bit, I like rocking up and down to give them a little bit of extra movement to get some good bubbles in the parachute. Let's shake, shake, shake it slowly, shake, shake, shake it slowly, shake, shake, Shake it slowly here at Rump and Roll. Good job. Now, remember earlier that reciprocal arm motion? That means going one and two. We're going to do the same thing except really, really fast. You ready? On your mark, get set. Let's shake, shake, shake it fast. Shake, shake, shake it fast. Shake, shake, shake it fast. Here at Rump and Roll, now we're going to shake and shake and shake and stop. Oh, that's a good word to learn the meaning of, right? Here we go, let's try again. Let's shake and shake and shake and stop. Oh, great job. Here, let's try one more time, but this time we're gonna do lots of shakes. You ready? Here we go. Let's shake and 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 shake shake and 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 shake shake and 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 stop oh great one now by now there should be some bubbles all here on the parachute we're going to do an exercise that's going to work on our little ones lower backs see we're going to have them lean over and pop those bubbles. Now, this is the one time where I actually say, please encourage your little one to do this, even if they're feeling a little bit hesitant. The reason why some of our smallest friends are hesitant to do this is because when they get here, they're going to get stuck right here. We're gonna give them some extra time in this song to practice walking their hands and lifting their bodies up up, up. That's the real exercise. Okay, you ready? Let's try. We're going to get some bubbles, get some ripples. We're going to bend our little ones down. Let's pop, pop, pop the bubbles. Now walk up, 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 up. Again, ready? Let's pop, pop, pop the bubbles and walk up, 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 up. One more time, ready? Let's pop, pop, pop the bubbles. Up, 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 up. Bonus one, ready? Pop, 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 pop. And go 
up, 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 up. Ooh, great job. But you know what? I think it's time to play one more quick game. Hey, Rompy, I'm gonna grab little Rompy. Ah, there he is. You can grab your little one's favorite toy as well. Because we're gonna play a little bit, bit of an object permanence game. It's called, Where'd the Toy Go? Or Where'd Little Rompy Go? So, Little Rompy, you're going to hide. Whoop. Now, we're going to cover up our little one's toy, so that way it's a little hidden. And try and figure out, where did it go? Hey, Rompy, where did Little Rompy go? Oh, no. It's hard for Rompy to see where he went. That's because he's working on object permanence. That means the ability to remember that something still exists, even if you can't see it or hear it. Now, if we can give a little peek right here. Whoop, whoop. There he is. Hmm? Let's try again. A little peek. Hup, hup. And hopefully our little ones will grab on the parachute and try and lift it up to grab your favorite toy. Now, if their little one is having a little extra challenge, that is okay. This is an emerging skill for some of our youngest friends. But I like to make it a little bit easier by grabbing something that makes sound, like our belts. That way, when we hide our uh, toy underneath, whoop, if I want to give Rompy a hint that that toy is still there, I can always grab onto it and just go. There it is. Eventually, he will crawl under, grab on, and go lift. <gasps> there it is. You found it. Ah. This is a game that you can play with your little ones at home with their favorite toy. Now, it is time for us to sing our goodbye song. Ready? Let's take their little hands and go clap, 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 clap. Let's take their little hands and go clap, 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 clap. clap. Let's take their little feet and go stomp, 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 stomp. Let's take their little feet and go stomp, 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 stomp. Let's take their little arms and go hug, 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 hug. Hug, 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 let's take their little arms and go. Hug, 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 hug. Let's take our little hands and wave. Bye, 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 bye. Let's take our little hands and wave. Bye, 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 we'll see you here next time. Now. We will appear next on our main Facebook page on Monday for a Tumble Tunes class at uh, in the morning. <laughs> uh, please uh, check out our Facebook page. We're going to be posting our schedule there. Though, if you're a part of the Richmond member page, later on today at 1030, Miss Anna will be coming back for a music and movement class. Oh. And uh, be sure to reach out to your local Romp and Roll's favorite uh, page, uh, their member page, to see when your favorite instructors are going to be doing classes of their own. All right, we're going to sing goodbye. We're going to go bye bye, Mr. Daniel. Bye bye, Rompy. Bye bye, everybody. <laughs> We'll see you here next time. Goodbye.